Today we're going to look at the column command. Uh, this is a question that comes in from a viewer, one guy one, uh, and basically he's wondering how to take uh, the output of maybe a CVS file or just a file with uh, information in it and put it into evenly distributed columns. So for example, I made up this little file, um, data CVS, although it's not really comma separated, but I've got a column, which is a product. I got apples, pineapples, and pies. The second column is the price. And the third column is the quantity on hand. So as you can see, just catting out the information, you get very uneven columns. Um, so what we want is to have very easy to read columns so you know you know, you don't get the quantity mixed up with the price or the other way around. So the simplest way to do that is to use the column command. And uh, all we have to do is column, and we're gonna use the T switch in this case, and then the name of the file, and we'll hit enter, and you'll see that it's a lot easier to read. You can very easily see the different columns. You can also, in case you need to uh, convert, you know, cut out stuff first. If it's a CVS file, you want to remove the delimiters. Uh, depending on what you need to do, you can also pipe into the column command. So once again, if we do data.csv, uh, we get uh, this information here. Data.csv, once again, is the file name. We can always pipe into the column command here. And for what we're trying to do, we want the T switch. As you can see, it outputs the information. Obviously, that is not needed. That, but as I said, if it's a call, if you have it comma separated and you wanted to remove the commas first or remove certain columns, you can pipe it through a cut or awk or something, and then finally throw it into the column command to display the output. So this was a quick tutorial, but I hope you found it useful, and I hope you visit bashscripts.info or filmsbychris.com. Uh, the links are in the description, and I hope you subscribe and feel free to comment if you have any questions. Have a great day.